Sonny, welcome to Ipswich Town. First of all, just talk to me a little bit about how the move came about. Um, it's been a long day. These days are always quite long days. Um, I think the, I heard the interest first, it was been a few weeks ago. Um, I think was, a lot of people know I've been, I did pre-season at Derby, so that was where well, I've been the last three, three or four weeks. Um, so then they've both been kind of rumbling on and at some point you got to make a decision. Um, and then yesterday was got us over the line, so it's good to be here. Um, manager, I spoke to manager earlier today, and just looking forward to the the, the project's clear. There's a, a lot of change going on here. Um, new ownership and a whole new squad by the side of things. So um, I'm excited. I'm excited to be part of that, and looking forward to a positive future. How were those chats with the manager earlier today? Yeah, they were good, positive. Um, you no, know, I'm not not new to English football, so he's known about my game for a while. Played against his teams a few times. Um, so just be about how he wants to play, how way he sees me in the team, what I think I can add to the team. Um, it's been a bit of a young squad, so I've played in this league a long time now, so that hopefully I can, you know, add some experience. But first of all, just get to know them, you know, get for them to get to know me and their trust, and we'll, we'll build something from there. Like you say, you have been in the English game for a while now, but for those who may not know too much about you, what what can the fans expect? Um, no, I don't. Particularly that I speak myself that way, but you know I've been fortunate enough to have a you know a career I'm happy with, successful with. I've copied as a Premier League and two promotions and Championship, um, in the last four seasons, um, at, at Reading, which was has been some good seasons, some some struggling seasons. So I've had a, a mixture of you know top both ends of of Championship and and Premier League, and this is my first my first time into into League One. So hopefully I can like I said bring some experience and you know bring the way I play and, and help the team in that way, you know, I'm an attacking player, I'm, you know, explosive player, I like to use my pace and create chances, try and score goals and, you know, just contribute to the team in, in that way. Yeah, you've, you've mentioned the word experience a couple of times, how important can that be, especially if a team is to achieve a goal like promotion? Yeah, it's, there's, there's, no, there's no replacement for it. Um, in, in, a, in a season this long that we have, we have in, you know, in Championship or League One, you play Fifty plus games, you're gonna have some some tough moments. There's gonna be some some testing periods, and especially when when I was young, I think for young players, it's always how you, how you manage that, and even when you're being very successful, how you manage that because, like I say, it's very rare you're gonna have a season of just pure highs. So, I think I've just learned how to weather it, and you know, be quite stable through the season. And hopefully, that rubs off on the other players, and how to manage yourself, your body, how to manage your training, you know, all, all those things. It, it comes with experience and doing it over and over again. So. I've been fortunate even before I came to England in you know, Aberdeen, played European games or Rangers, a massive club playing in front of 50,000 every week. So the pressure of having fans back, that's going to be challenging for some young players. So looking forward to it all, looking forward to getting in front of fans again. Um, that's, why, that's why you enjoy football so as a player, that's why you want to play football. Um, so yeah, like I said, I'm, that's, I'm just excited. Yeah, like you just mentioned the fans, unfortunately you're unable to play tomorrow, but how much are you looking forward to getting out in front of a, a big crowd here at Portman Road? Yeah, for sure. It's um, it's a, it's a stadium that's it's well known that you know have a, a strong support and, and a good fan base. Um, I'm most likely to be at the game tomorrow watching, so I'll be in the, in there, soaking in the atmosphere and, and watching the watching the boys play. But yeah, it's it's what I'm really looking forward to. Just like I said, as a footballer, just playing in front of fans, home fans, away fans. You know, it's it's all exciting. But definitely, you know, want to give them something to be, to to cheer and support. We've just been talking off camera. A lot of change has happened this summer. You're you're the twelfth signing yeah. of the summer. How much are you looking forward to just being part of the the project here? Yeah, you know I, I wouldn't be here if I, if I didn't want to do it. Um, it's it's one of the things that attracted me. That okay, they're they're really trying to build something. They're ambitious. Um, that's going to match my ambition because I'm not going to hide it. I want to go back and play in championship. So you know, I hope to take Ipswich back up there. Um. So yeah, it's been it was a selling point for the manager. But with a new squad, it, it takes it's gonna take a while. You know that doesn't happen overnight, doesn't click overnight. So players have to be patient. The fans will have to be patient at some points, and we know that it's it's challenging. But it's 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 responsibility. You know when you when you're trying to build something, and you you attract players that were they've attracted and young players and experienced players, and we have to take that, take that on board and deal with the pressure of the expectation of fans will expect us to to go back up. So it's something I'm embracing and looking forward to. Just finally, like you said, you you've spent pre season with Derby. So how close do you feel in terms of how match sharp you might be in full fitness? 
Yeah, it's, it's, it's good that I've, I've done a pre-season with a team, that's for sure. Um, like I said, well, once you get close to the transfer, the, the last few days has been more negotiating rather than training, so that's been been unfortunate, and obviously I can't play tomorrow, so I'm, I'm not a million miles away, you know. I'm sure I'll be involved in the, the cup game, hopefully. Um, and then we'll take it from there, but yeah, I'll be, as soon as I can sign, I'll be, I'll be ready to start playing. Thanks, Sonny, and welcome to the club.